Hi guys, welcome to chapel. It's Pastor Katie and I'm so glad that you are here today. Today we're going to read a scripture from our Old Testament, the part of Bible before Jesus walked here on earth and be reminded that the joy, the love, the hope, the happiness we have, all the blessings in our life come from God. But before we begin, let's spend a moment in prayer. I'll say it first, you say it after me. Let's pray. Loving God, today we worship you. Thank you for Jesus, who teaches us how to love. Send your Holy Spirit to help us worship. Amen. Amen. Let's sing with Miss Pam. Hi, preschool and kindergarten friends. This is Miss Pam. We have one last song for you this year, and this is called The Butterfly. And Pastor Katie is going to help do some motions that you all can do in your classrooms, and I will sing it, and eventually you can learn the words to this one too. Um. If I were a butterfly, I thank you, Lord, for giving me wings. And if I were a robin in a tree, I thank you, Lord, that I could sing. And if I were a fish in the sea, I'd wiggle my tail and I'd giggle with glee. But I just thank you, Father, for making me me. For you gave me a heart and you gave me a smile. You gave me Jesus and you made me your child. And I just thank you, Father, for making me me. If I were a wiggly worm, I thank you, Lord, that I could squirm. And if I were a crocodile, I thank you, Lord, for my big smile. And if I were a fuzzy wuzzy bear, I thank you, Lord, for my fuzzy wuzzy hair. But I just thank you, Father, for making me me. For you gave me a heart and you gave me a smile. You gave me Jesus and you made me your child. And I just thank you, Father, for making me me. Thanks, Miss Pam. I love that song. And it's perfect for this week as we think about all the things that bring us joy or happiness. Do you know that word joy? Can you show me a joyful face or a joyful body? You're full of energy. You're really excited. Amazing things are happening. You might be surprised. There's certainly a smile on your face, even under your mask. We are celebrating today and hearing today in our Bible that it is God who gives us joy, that we have so many blessings to be thankful for and that our joy comes from God. Let me read to you this scripture. It's from Psalm 19. Remember um, Psalm 16. Remember that the Psalms are songs that used to be sung in the community of believers. This is from Psalm 16. David writes, you teach me the ways of life, O Lord. In your presence is a total celebration. Beautiful things are always in your hands. Can you think of some of the things in our world that are just amazing, that just bless you, that make you so happy and full of life? I can think about the flowers that are growing in my garden. Anybody else have flowers growing in their garden? I can think about the songs that fill my heart, that make my whole body want to move. I can think about the friends. Does anybody have a friend? You can point to them in your class. People who filled you with love and grace. I can think about my family. There are so many things that I am thankful for that bring me joy and happiness. Take one minute and turn to your friend or your teacher and tell them something that brings you joy. Ready? One, two, three. Okay. I. I didn't hear that. Can we try it again? Can you tell me the things that bring you joy? Ready? One, two, three. Well, in my message box, I have something that brings me joy. It would have been really hard to fit my family in here. It, it would have been really hard to fit my dog or my hedgehog in here. It would have been really hard to fit my house or, or the whole church building in here. But I did put something in here that makes me happy. Do you know what these are? That's right, they're bubbles. 
And every time I blow bubbles, I think about all the things that are a blessing. And I'm gonna blow some bubbles right now and I want you to think about it. For every bubble, see if you can think of something that brings you joy, that is a blessing that comes from God. Maybe I'm not being a very good bubble blower here. What is something that you're thankful for? Is it your family? Or your pets? There's a bunch. Could it be your friends? It can be a stuffed animal or your LOL doll. It can be your trucks, things that we're thankful for. But we have so many things in our lives that give us joy and they are all gifts from God. Hi, I'm Devin. I am the contemporary worship leader here at Mumsy and I'm going to play every move I make. Every move I make, I'm making you. You make me move, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Waves of mercy, waves of grace everywhere. I see your face, your love has captured me, oh my God, this love, how can it be? Every move I make, I'm making you, you make me move, Jesus, every breath I take, I breathe in you. Every step I take, I take in you. You are my way, Jesus. Every breath I take, I breathe in you. Waves of mercy, waves of grace. Everywhere I look, I see your face. Your love has captured me. Oh my God, this love. How can it be? Thanks, Mr. Devon. Well, my hope is that this week you will look at all of the many blessings you have and give thanks for the way that God is working and moving. After all, everything is a celebration of God's love and joy in your life. Can I pray for you? Gracious God, thank you so much for these children and all the children of our church. We ask that you'd bless them and keep them and that you fill them with joy.